Hey there, folks, before we get in the episode proper, uh, fuck you, Susan Wojcicki, fuck you, pro clutching parents, and, uh, fuck you, politicians who, uh, greenlit the COPPA bill. You're all dicks, and I hope you, uh, get slapped in the face in the next year. Hey there, folks, as far as you're concerned, my name is Freak with a Pen, and this is After Party, and last time we met up with Satan and Satan's posse, which included, I believe, Asmodeus, Alelion, why am I pretending like I remember any of the names except for fucking Chad? Because once again, of course there's a Chad in Satan's posse. And uh, we were given the task of uh, out drinking Satan's siblings. Mr. Andy, have I ever told you that you remind me of my uncle, who would take me upon his shoulders to pick apples in the summer? <sighs> We're all mass murderers, nostalgia humpers, there's a gist you, Roberto. Like I said, Mr. Andy, I did not commit the crimes I am accused of. My name's Andrelfis, Roberto. I'm your court-ordered attorney, remember? And as soon as my paralegal shows up, we're going to trial and you're probably going to burn. So, save the my talking parakeet made me do a defense till then, okay? Ciao, ragazzi, please. Could you, can you help? Is he talking to us? You. I'm talking to the two of you. Do not be afraid. Sure, what, what do you need? Bless you, bless you. Uh, perhaps uh, you will indulge me by performing me a small favor. Uh, could you just, uh, just straighten my hair a little? Mi madre, God rest her soul, would never want me to look so disheveled. As you can see, I am bound so I cannot reach my head. Please, it is a kindness I would cherish to my soul. Right. Uh -huh. What you do, you lean in and bite my face off, is that the deal? Use my face as a skin mask to escape your confines? I do not know of any deal, but I am not so inventively rude. Please. By helping my hair, it may be the last piece of affection I am allowed before eternal damnation. Fuck it. Fine. There. Your, your madre would be proud. Or at least less, slightly less ashamed. Grazie, grazie. Thank you ever so much. May you meet souls as nice as you on your journey through Hades. That's not exactly saying much. Oh god, was that another thing? It's just like, mmm, hmm, mmm. Was that another one of these things where, uh, it's, uh, this is, this kind of crap is gonna be like the sort of, like in the old King's Quest games, where depending on all the little side, the little side quests and additional stories that you did, more people would show up at the end and say, Hey, they're not complete shitbags. Just got back on back from the clinic. Looks like now I'm an ST demon. Uh oh. Hmm. I mean, at least you're good enough. Uh, thought. You think after you're dead, people look through your browsing history for laughs? You know, like the way they look through old pictures. Why wouldn't they? I know I'd want to see how much you like, you know, big asses. It's not the worst thing you could think of. I don't watch a lot of male-directed porn, okay? I prefer my porn AI compiled from National Geographic documentaries. Right. Oh, that's still so gross. Like, again, I get it. We're in hell. There, If there are bars in hell, it would be named after gross shit like this, but... Ugh. The sealed knot. I think this is the place. Excuse us, we're just gonna... Just gonna what? It's demonic entities only beyond this point. Incubi, succubi, demons of fate, familiars, leviathans, Norwegians, CEOs of Walmart. We get it. I'm sure there are other more appropriate Norwegians that would be more than happy to serve. Uh, listen, bouncer guy, we're here to see Apollyon, so why don't you step aside and... <laughs> and no one just sees Apollyon. 
But... There is pleasure in the pathless woods, friends. Know what that means. Get the fuck out. Get the fuck out of here, yes. Um, excuse me, uh, fellow, fellow demon. Make way for Coleco Magnavox, the demon of, uh, foot hands. Oh, right this way, sir. Okay, so, I have another interesting... Was that what I thought it was? Was that two fucking humans pulling a little rascals? I... Oh, but I want you to promise that you won't make fun of me if it's dumb. They say there's a fine line between madness and genius. And I feel like I might have broken through to the other side. Do you really think of me as someone who's looking to humiliate you at every turn? You can only pants someone on the jungle gym so many times, Lola, but look. What? Think about it. How many tattered curtains and loose skulls have you seen while we've been down here? That was like Barney the Clown's big top Halloween shop, but less emotionally scarring. So, so all we need to do is put together a costume slash disguise. And then we come back here and stroll right past this uppity moron. It, it, anyways, I was saying that I think we should disguise ourselves as a demon. So, so we can sneak into the sealed knot, yeah? Uh, have I lost you? I did, didn't I? I mean, as far-fetched as it is, it's not half bad. Almost as good as your instant s'mores idea. Yeah, but this idea won't get ruined by a German microwave. Let's go shopping. Shopping? I was trying to... let's find the materials to make a costume. Oh, sorry. I mean, there already are instant s'mores. They're called moon pies. Uh, hey, so when you told Sam about how I was gonna work with my mom... Yeah? Well, you... Uh, I don't know. You, you didn't seem... Uh, well, you did seem a little... Like... I, I, I don't know the word I'm looking for here. Like, uh... Oh, geez, I need like a thesaurus. Uh, did I sound happy for you? Cause I am. I'm happy as a damn clam you're staying behind to build breakaway furniture for magician wrestlers. Yeah, you really sound clam happy right now. I mean, you're just... It's just weird, because you're the one that's moving. Uh, I'm staying in town. What the hell does that mean? Well, it means if anyone should feel, like, betrayed or whatever, it's me. Not that either of us do. Or would. Ever. I'm just living my life, Milo. Or living my truth, as my aunt would say. Mostly when she wanted to wear her bra as a belt. Okay, I don't even know why I brought it up. It was just your... your tone back there. Well, neither do I. We got a lawyer demon to outsauce, so get fucking frosty. So I probably should have been walking during that. I just wanted to point out how I thought it was weird that three of these mouths that are barfing up blood look bummed out, and just one is just fucking loving it. Oh. Okay. I got real worried. I'll be honest, I am... I'm real worried anytime this game freezes slightly. Because I'm... I just... I, frankly, I just know it's just gonna... F I, that this thing could fall the fuck apart. I just... I've never experienced any game where the loading bar went backwards. That just doesn't seem like a good thing. Eh. Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. What can we find on this level? Dirty, hurdy, gurdy. Can we go in there? No, fuck. Where the fuck can a guy get a decent candied apple down here? Well, I mean, it's hell, so probably nowhere. So there is f fuck all down this way. Good. 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 Huh. 
Okay, let's uh let's 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 let's, let's go up that one area. Popcorn in teeth. Hell's hot AF, but the coffee is lukewarm, got it. Mm. Well, I mean again, hell. So yeah. Do you think that's what hell is? Just like a series of minor inconveniences? Like, I I almost get the feeling that that would be like so much worse than like actual torture. Because then you have the mental... The sign says that giant door is the... the... 87th propyleum to the nine circles. The Yamaloka. One of the many doorways to hell. Ours are Cockrow to Eventide. And if all goes to plan, we'll be telling Weekly World News about it well before uh, Cockrow. Yeah, I really don't need to see what's on the other side. Really? Because the only thing I see on that sign is Giant Gate of Hell. Um... And my computer is sounding like it's trying to choke itself to death. So I'm just going to real quick just, uh, yep, turn that off. The unchased crater. It says it's where Satan landed when God threw him out of heaven. Yeah, it looks like he left a big hole. I think he's calling it unchaste because God was being rude. What does the sign say this time? The hole where Satan fell. Again, getting a lot of information from these... Uh, oh, that's not a uh, way to continue. Okay. Uh, it's really hard to get food porn pics. In oh, that's... Like, I know that food porn is a turn... I hate that, by the way. That, uh... You know, people are like, Oh, it's sound porn, because, you know, it's it, it goes into, the, like, the detail. It was just like, Stop fucking up my Google searches with your kitschy bullshit. The Karma Magistratus, the Great Hall of Cosmic Justice. I wonder what kind of cases they see. You'd think this stuff would be worked out pretty well in advance. Yeah, it's probably like people who brag a little too much about getting a good parking space, you know? Like, do they deserve to be tortured in hell for... Yes. <laughs> I think the kind of people who brag about what parking space they got have already gone through their punishment of living a life so pathetic that the only thing that they can brag about is how good their fucking parking space is. No, it's one cup mashed up nose weevil, a half cup body butter, three eggs... What kind of eggs? Uh, soft shell turtles if they're in season, a little flour, Hateful flower. Uh huh. And what about. <laughs> and then we skin fry some unicorns and toss them in oil. Sounds great. I'll take one. Here you go. The fuck is hateful flower? I regret having that. They're still working out the recipe. Uh, sure, Welcome fuck it. Children! Jump, children, <laughs> please! Take some treats from Treat Cart. I'm Lutzelfau, and my charming Germanic witch recipes will surely soak up all that alcohol. We're not drunk. Then pretend, okay? <coughs> the rebel here is more discerning than Lutzelfau expected. They don't serve lava blasters here, so everyone still has their taste buds. Okay, well, slow down here a minute then. We're, uh, 
Well, you know, we're intelligent people, and intelligent people require some measure of... Got you selfish little pricks! You'll shut down the borders if a kumquat slips past Mexico, but you have to barter with my shit! Just tell yes. little Frau what you want, or be gone quickly! Your dress, I it's so... I've just never seen this fabric before, and it's so hard to go thrift store shopping in hell without a purse. Ah, what an eye you have! The fabric is a mesh sewn from the hair of children born during an eclipse. You can only acquire it through Mazoku rituals or Thursday night specials, of course. For this, you'll need to sell your love for Lutzelfrau's treats. Good, my dear. Give me, uh, just give me your least disgusting piece of crap. Uh, but not, uh, not literal poop, please. Right. Good catch. Eh, uh, what's fuck the it. hold up? So you like Lutzelfrau's Ebola bellied rats, do you, my dear? Oh, my dear Jesus, it's 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 so damn good. <laughs> I can't, I, I, I can't even. Uh, hey, that idiot tried that weird witch's candy. They love it. Holy shit! Let's go, guys. Come on, let's get some candy. Yeah. Ready. Oh, yes, come on. There's no need to shove. I have so many sauces for all my diseased meats. Okay, now, the dress, if you please. Give us the... the dress, you... Oh, God. Mm. Why is that word? <laughs> okay, follow Lutzelfrau. And smile, dipshits, you're on camera, all right? So no samples while I'm gone. So, you're sharing, I presume? Who's gonna be the hit, and who's gonna be the tail? Oh, oh yeah, you're like way taller, aren't you? <laughs> Weight and good taste dictate I get on top. Hope you're cool with that? Yeah, of course I'm cool with it. Yeah, I was embarrassed to be the top cheerleader on the pyramid in junior high. Well, I was embarrassed for you for other closely related reasons, but yeah. Ta-da! Perfect. I'll be honest, I wouldn't let you buy Lutzelfrau a drink. Those mother... Hell is really filled with cock knockers, you know? You wouldn't... You wouldn't think it, but there it is. I mean... Okay, whoa. It is hell. your shoulder so much, it's... Your skull is pressed up against my junk. I'm sorry, it's... I don't want to say you're heavy, but... You're, uh... Not that easy to carry. Oh, watch it. I'm not kidding. Well, I'm not saying... Just forget it, it's fine. You're... you're... You're light as a feather, a hummingbird feather. Just take it easy. Just stop humping my I'm neck. Not humping your neck. Just stop rubbing your crotch on my neck. How do you think I can stay on? I'm. Okay, right, just forget it. Telly ho, telly, <laughs> telly forth. Let's just get to the ball, okay? Let's get to Polly. <laughs> You've been here for a day. Why the fuck do you think demons say telly ho? I just love the way that <laughs> that they move in the costume. <laughs> just top 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 top. Uh, it's very it's very uh it's very like rubber hose. You know what I mean? Stow the human and carry on. I'll <clears throat> have to check with the owner. Then check with him. I've got less than an hour till trial. Ciao, ragazzo. Another beautiful day in hell. You seem like a well-to-do demon. Very put together. Of scale like a camel. Perhaps you know Andrelfus. Andy? He is my handler. It's us, Roberto. The humans from earlier, Milo and Lola. We are in disguise. <gasps> Bella Arte. Wonderful craftsmanship, truly. Good luck to you, my dear hair friends. My hair thanks you. Shut up and leave that handsome demon alone. Okay, you guys are all set. She's in the back. Move. 
walk straight to the kitchen and get into the flower drawer. Of course, of course. Mm. So if we hadn't, he would have fucked us over. I see. Mm, all right. Okay. Good evening, madam. Right this way. Good man. Oh, I'm sorry, sir. I thought you were a woman at first. <sighs> Get ready to see some wild shit. Let's try not to draw any more attention to ourselves than we need to. Okay, but don't talk anymore. Demon's guts can't speak, I don't think. We're gonna need a refill. I mean, yeah, and, how do you know? Something to fish out the teeth? What are you saving up for college? Huh? There's not enough liquor in my liquor. Gerald. Yeah, yeah. Why don't you give Father Barleycorn here a break? All right. Okay, fine. Sorry, Barley. Didn't know you didn't know how to make a drink. It's all right, Jerry. Thank you, Judge Apollyon. Holy shit. The, uh, the monarch, uh, Apollyon, she's right there. I can, I can see her. Okay, well, it's it's hard to really walk uh, steadily. Just take it slow and don't draw attention to yourself, ourselves. So how bad do you think it'll fuck it up wow, if we drink? Supermodel convention show up? What can I get you? Let's see who we... The, the Horde and Squander... Uh, liquid courage, whiskey, sulfur, hexafluoride, robot parts. <laughs> Alright, red dye number three. Oh, is that what I think in that cup? Oh boy, the blue devil, rich asshole. Potato vodka, cigarette butts, the wailing of injured children, melted... Anatonius? The fuck is... The hell is that? Uh, A N T. Oh, it's like a uh, huh. It's like an old Roman coin. Neat. I thought that was jizz in the glass. The Grand Expedition... Yeah, ex... Grand Ex... Why can't I say this word? Expeditionist. No, not expedi... Fuck. I can't say the word. I don't know why. I'll leave a space here in case I'm able to actually get it out of my stupid fucking mouth later. Okay, then. Witty Vaudevillian. Uh, bourbon, mint, sugar, frog, vocal sack. Ugh. Hearse chaser, liquid courage, gumption, horse saliva, rock salt, and lots of gin. There's also clearly a rose in there. Or is that what a gumption is? I'll go with this. Exhibitionist. exhibitionist. That's what the fucking word is. Got the guy next to me chugging exhibitionists. Won't stop making awful jokes. Someone ah, cap his tab, please. <laughs> Why do you ask? Because you sound like you got a baby stuck in your throat with that nasally human voice. It's hill flu season, so... I just want to know if I should put on a mask. No, I'm uh, doing just fine. Just snorted too much hell cocaine before I got here. Hell cocaine? <laughs> that sounds like something two humans disguised as one gangly demon would say. <laughs> Not that that would ever happen. Oh, <laughs> oh man, that would be a sight. Okay, we have a drink. Let's party. Yes. Before we do that, though, Hello, I do want to talk fellow, to this guy. Fellow specters of malevolence, can I can I help you with something? This is funny. <laughs> we look uh, pretty similar, right? Don't you think? Yeah, a classic summer style down here, right? All right, fair enough. Uh, 
you know what? I think that's gonna be it for today's episode. Thank you guys for watching. Please consider like, commenting, subscribing, sharing, and dinging the bell. And I will hopefully see you guys next time. Bye.